What's going on? He's not in his room. Kevin's gone missing. He's not home. We could do this video diving. My friend did this video diving. We could put it around the world. And teach him a lesson yet? No, I have no part in all of this. I, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But I want out. Kevin! It's your Auntie Gloria, Auntie Glor Glor. Yeah, yeah, enough of that, son that, whatever, who cares? <laughs> your parents, <laughs> we're all looking for you. Where are you? Where the hell are you? Jesus is my portion. Mm -hmm. Hello, Kevin. <laughs> He's a cool guy, a bit wimpy. Uh, Damar. Hmm, he's forgetful, uh, trying to step up uh, the 800 stuff, and Diva, she's just, uh, loose. Uh, she's not really doing it. And, uh, my boy, she's a freak, like, a hairy face and all of that, like, that. Many on that, that auntie Gloria, she's like, she's always messing up the family, you get me, like, she like, too involved and always telling everyone her business and stuff like that. Always quick to jump on the internet and stuff like that. And it's just like, cool, but I'm gonna do my bit and just wind up the family. And like, tell a little bit of porcupines and stuff like that, a little bit of lies, just for the fun of it. And then maybe I might say where Kieran actually is, or when I last saw Kieran the truth. But right now, I'm just enjoying it, watching the family go crazy. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out. I don't want to go back We got a fight! I swear, Kevin is dead. Look, Auntie Gloria is dead. Oh. Anyway, Kevin is dead. He, 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 my friend, he told me that Kevin lied and he's, he's been living on this fake name, DeAndre, and just... He had an accident or got stabbed or something like that. So, I mean, I haven't seen the body, but I guess... He's buried here or something. We just came from the church. You know the name of who got stabbed? Kieran, but he's lying and telling everyone that his name's DeAndre. Well, the church service was alright, but we never get to see the body. But I think it's Kieran, because my friend wouldn't lie to me and say that Kieran is, you know, stabbed. He wouldn't just wind me up and tell me that Kieran is dead and Kieran's not dead. He would be honest with me. Because he's a true friend. That's what friends are for. And you wonder why I don't come home.
and the church video where Gloria sang beautiful and blessed my soul. If you haven't seen it, please go. Check it. Wash it. I'm doing this video diary because the family asked for my help. I'm new to this situation. When the family came to my church, I didn't know what was going on in their lives. It's because I keep myself to myself, trying not to interfere, stay out of other people's business. So, oh, oh, this is this is this is this is it. Oh, this is this is this is where he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. I, I, I knew it. I knew it. Take off your hat. Have respect. He's dead. Karen, do you hear me? Oh, no, he can't hear you. He's dead. Karen, he's dead. Why did he change his name? Why couldn't he come home? Why did he die? Those are big. Hmm? I haven't seen less in a long time. Those have gone bigger. Hmm. I'm growing up. Oh. Well, I'm, I'm not the only one. Everyone got their breasts done. Where did you get the money from? Huh? Where did you get the money from? I'm, I'm sorry, I don't understand that question. Go on, tell him. Where did you get the money from? She took the money from Kieran. We put, put this money together for the search party for Kieran and she stole it to get her breasts done. Yes, she's always saying she's going to get herself pampered. All she's caring about is herself. She's the reason why Kieran died. Jamal! She's so selfish. But wait a minute. Kieran's friend told him to run away. Oh, I, I can't take this anymore, kids. Disrespect no manners. I can't take this anymore. You're just like your father. But what happened? <laughs> Kieran was rude and ignorant and out of order. Like Damar, Kieran didn't listen to authority. He thought he was big and bad. So I show you who's big and bad because I won the house. Oh, Mum runs the house. <laughs> right, when we get home, I love being junior you see. Look, Kieran, I don't want to dis I don't want to disrespect you. But no, actually, no, since Kieran is here and you're here, let's all say it here. Kieran was rude, he, he was smoking with his little rank and smell. You think I want my children to do that? Mum! And I'm not judging the video. He who is without sin, let him first cast a stone. Jesus said to those who brought a woman caught committing adultery. John 8, verse 4 to 11. It's there. And they said, this woman was caught in the very act of committing adultery. In our law, Moses commanded us to stone to death such woman. What do you say? They say this. Trying to tempt him. So that they might found ground for bringing charges against him. Jesus bent down, wrote on the ground with his finger, as though he heard them not. When they kept questioning him, he strengthened up and said to them, Anyone who is without sin among you, let him be the first to throw a stone at her. 
Oh my god, devant Il est ici Again, he bent down and started writing on the ground with his feet. Surprisingly, when it is strengthened up, he found himself alone with the accused woman. It said when they heard, they left one by one from the eldest to the last, leaving the woman. like he's this big bad man I'm not caring I don't look I don't like why people compare me to him he's moist in that crowd that day who also committed sin in different ways but only that they were not caught or flushed in Jesus was the only Jesus is the only and was the only sinless person in that assembly. The only person having the lawful right to pick stones and throw, not only at the woman, but to all of them, including the woman's accusers. Auntie Gloria! Auntie Gloria, wait! You can't leave what's here, Auntie Gloria! Auntie Gloria! No! What do you mean? What do you mean right our way home? We're in the middle of nowhere! Oh, I can't leave Jordan's home! You're so selfish sometimes! Oh my day, whatever! See you later! Jesus didn't condemn the woman didn't accuse the woman or judge the woman. He didn't judge his accusers. Neither did he find fault in the law or with the law. Nor Mendel with the magistrate's office which he found himself in it is they wanted him to judge. But with his sin, sinless nature, full of love, care, and mess, he said to the woman, Go, sin no more. He sent them with their caution. Knowing that judgment belongs to God the Father alone. And knowing that the judgment day is coming sooner or later. Wait a minute, ain't that Adam's house? Um, Adam, one of Kieran's mates. Where are you going? Adam must have known something about Kieran. He's one of his closest mates. Jay, Jay, leave it. Just allow it. Just leave it. I need to find some answers. What, what, what's Adam going to say? He's, he's got. Kieran's 
closest mate. Yes, but supposing he doesn't know anything. It's just gonna start a problem. You know, Adam, he's not the person you should be messing with. He's dangerous, man. You don't know, get on the wrong side of Adam. Just leave it. Plus, look, I know you're having a lot to deal with with this whole sick tearing situation and you didn't know much about it. But really don't get involved because Diva ran away from home because of the stress when she got involved. I fell inside the graveyard. Auntie Glorious, she stormed off and she just said, you know what, because you really peed her off, she said, go find your own way home. I was, she wanted me to come in the car with her, but I'm not going to leave answers. you. I wasn't talking about violence, I just want to know some answers. But Adam's not, he's not that type of person. He's going to be angry and he's, he doesn't want to talk to you. He's not a very approachable person. Let me not start preaching. If you want to hear more about this topic, go to my website, the Holy Ghost Word Com. Back to Gloria. The family is in my prayers. Praying for Gloria. Hoping that Kirio is safe and will come home soon, very soon. I'm asking you, the audience, for prayer. Pray for the Lord's family. Pray for the returning of Kirio home. See, dig into his mom's loving, caring hands. Pray for me as well as I pray for you. Thank you for, you, for your time. Sorry for pushing you in that grave. It's cool, bro. It's cool. Don't worry. I really feel bad. I'm just angry. Yeah, but I guess we just need to just stick together and just be cool and just. I think Diva would. Not of them, Diva's a girl where she's 19, 21, so she's cool. She will find a house and she will, she keeps in contact. Kieran, I guess what we need to do is just sort out our family and hopefully Kieran will come home. But let's just not make this family more of a mess than it actually is. So me and you, we're going to stick together, right? Yeah. And we're gonna I'll look after you, you look after me. Like brothers should do. And if Auntie Gloria really winds you up, just you yeah, know, ignore her. But forget the family because they're always messing us up. And bros, we sit together. Right? Cool. Alright, so should we go get something to eat? I'll sell your hat and get some money and then we'll use this to buy food. What? You, you, you don't want to eat today? I do. Yeah, so I'm going to sell this, get some money, and then, no, because this is like four pounds and no, you, know, you can get... No, it's 15 pounds. I see, more food. <laughs> what, you're not making enough food? No, we're going to sell this, get some food, get money. Well, okay, you're starving today, you're starving. You see, not all pastors are nutters as they portrayed on television. It's annoying me. I feel sick every time I hear those mocking words, mocking Jesus Christ. But one thing I know, the judgment day is approaching. You might say, we have heard this before, waited for so long and nothing This is this is the this is the word that the present heavens and earth having been preserved are being kept for fire. Judgment day. 
My dear friends, don't ignore this. With the Lord, a day is like a thousand years. A thousand years is like a day. Thank you once again for your time. Go in peace. Kirion, if you are listening, please, please, please come home. It's Gloria, glue, glue. And I just wanted to say, um, could you make sure that you like, subscribe, and share? Mm -hmm. Like, subscribe, and share the um the videos you've seen. Check it out. Like, subscribe, and share to your mates to help send off the search party for Kieran. Um, message that we really want to find Kieran. So we need your help to give this video a thumbs up. Um, like, subscribe, and share. If you want to see more of us, Ooh. why do I put myself in difficult situations? Only God knows, but yeah. Check us out. I'm going to go to church now. How do you think I look? Ready for church? I'm going to be singing my all time famous song. The only song we sing in church is Praise Jehovah. No, not all churches, only my church. We only sing Praise Jehovah. I do my little dance. Praise Jehovah. Praise Jehovah. He's a man of war. He's a mighty warrior. But yeah, make sure you like, subscribe, and share the search by for Kieran. I really got to go now, so I'll see you later. Bye. I'm not even going to pretend I'm walking down this way, because I ain't even going to jump. Gently.